Hello there. Today I am going to be showing you how to configure the OB scoreboard on OBS. So this is the final product here in the corner you can see and this is what it will look like. You can place it pretty much anywhere on the screen really and we have another design as well which I will show you towards the end of the video. So first click on the plus, click browser, click OK and then type in OB scoreboard dot com and change this to 1000 and click OK. Next, you're going to want to sign in if you haven't already. So, and if you haven't signed up, just go to OB scoreboard dot com to sign up. Right click on the browser, click interact and click sign in. Type in your details. Once you've logged in, click streaming scoreboard and then this will pop up. Click yes, continue and device one. And you'll see the scoreboard will appear. So next you're going to click on this and then you are going to click alt on Windows or option on a Mac and drag down. And then you're going to place it wherever you want on the screen so just click and drag if you want to move it and then increase the size by dragging the corner and then you can place it in the corner you can lock it in place if you like this just means you can't click it and move it by accident but you can see there it's in the bottom left in the corner um, I think it could actually be further into the corner uh, around there and yeah so you can Click race to eight, say, and then click plus. And the same again here. If you want to change it, then obviously you can add a flag. So I'm going to say Ireland and USA. So let's say John Doe versus Jane Smith. So that is that scoreboard. Now there is a remote control as well, which you can remotely control from your phone. So you can click generate code here, and this will generate a six digit code. And you just need to type this in to the remote control on your phone, which I will show in a second. There is also a second scoreboard design, which I'm going to show now. So you can click that and then you can say from, say, Ireland and USA. And then close that and then you can unlock it again and drag it across to the center. And then you can lock it again. So that's it for the scoreboard. Now I'm going to show you the remote control. So yeah, you'll see that it, all the settings from our original scoreboard sync up and when you click plus here or here you'll notice that it will sync also in the live scoreboard thanks a million for watching if you have any questions feel free to comment below or visit our website and send us a message thank you